Right, I'm going to show you the Carry Freedom Y-Frame Large trailer, which is for towing behind a bike. I'll show you how to set it up and what it's like when you're using it. So this is the trailer itself. You see it's got a um, load bed that's got a kind of grippy surface on it, and there's the, the Y-Frame. And it's going to have a tow point, and this can link two different ways, that way or that way so that you can fix it to either side of the bike. Okay, so the first job is to fit the wheels. We've got quick release axles. So you press the button and that then drops through the wheel. Press it again, drops into the frame, put in the little rubber cap to protect it. Now we do the same again on the other side. So the axle goes through the wheel there's the cap. So as you can see when it comes to dismantle it, to store it, you can very quickly pop the wheels off. Right, the next part is to attach the actual towing bar. So I'm going to have it on this side for this bike. And if you look at just this bit here, you line the holes up, pop this pin through, latch it on. Okay, so that's the trailer ready to go now. As you can see, very light, you can hold it on one finger. So the hitch for the trailer comes in two parts. This bit goes on the bike and this flexible plastic bit is going to hook on there and go into the bar that connects to the trailer. So we slide that through. There's a bolt that goes through. Nuts to go on the bottom. And you need a 4mm Allen key at this end and a 10mm spanner on the bottom. Okay, that's that bit done. So the next step is to fit this bracket onto the bike. So we'll remove the wheel nut. bracket goes on, you need to make sure you've got enough thread left here, we've got enough in this case. Now I've not got a washer so I'm going to turn this part way around as I tighten it. Okay, now the plastic sits over that. You can get several of these brackets, you can order more from the manufacturer so that you can have them on several bikes. Right, that's now ready. Okay, so just to show you how it goes together, I'm going to put one of these boxes on and have a go with it. Um, there's actually room to fit two of them on, have one like that, one like that. So they actually supply a couple of straps with it. You can use these to fasten the box down. Okay, ready to go. Pulling it on an electric bike here. With, uh, there is not to use it on a normal bike as well. One thing that's important to know is how easily you can turn it round. Okay, just to show the flexibility of this trailer, Tracy's going to have a little ride on it now. This is obviously something you do not do on a road.